Hello, muffins. Oh man, I just came in the house from work and I fell on the snow and bust my butt, okay? It was so freaking funny. This guy did help me up. He didn't laugh at me though. Um, that's good because I probably would have laughed. Oh my god, I hurt my hands so bad. But anyway, muffins, um, I just wanted to come in and to do an update, a really quick update because I just got in from work and I want to take this crap off. Okay, so let's start off with numbers and stuff. Um, I had my surgery December the 30th at Montefiore Hospital with Dr. V. I started out at 262. I stepped on the scale yesterday at the job and I am 230. 230? No. 235. Yeah. Is it 235? I think it was 235. So I think I've lost... Lord Jesus, whatever, subtract it for me, muffins. I'm too tired. Um, okay, so let me tell you what's been going on. Um, yesterday was a really, really hard day for me. I really, really didn't feel good. Um, I had ate a piece of uh, meat, and it didn't agree with my stomach, and it just knocked me off, off my behind all day. So I didn't feel good yesterday, um, but my eating has went back to normal. Um, I can basically eat anything right about now um I kind of eat not whatever I want but if I want something I'll eat it but I'll just eat it in small proportions because you know we can't eat that much um the worst thing I can say that I ate was I had made spaghetti like last week and I've been eating off of that for like maybe a couple of days maybe but it's a little portion of it um the pasta is wheat pasta, so it's not too bad. I can stomach that. Um, I can't stomach a lot of other things, like anything that's too sweet, I can't really stomach it. Um, the meat, I can't eat chicken. Like, I really can't eat chicken. Um, beef, I can kind of eat. Kind of. Not a lot. Um, kind of, it depends, like, how it's cooked or something. Um usually it just makes me sick so I try to stay away from meat and stuff um what else um I'm getting in a lot of my water which I was having a problem with it before I'm getting in a lot of water that is like really amazing for me um I don't like when I drink my water I don't put anything in it it's just cold and I can drink it that way so I'm drinking a lot of water um I stopped drinking the salsa water but I drink a lot of water um what else is going on um, I bought this new protein, it's called, and I want to write who I got the um, protein from, but it's an amazing protein. It actually supposed to come in the mail today, and I'll show you muffins, the protein that I am taking right now. I stopped taking the wee protein, like that big thing of wee protein that I showed y'all. Um, I don't know, I just can't really get into it. Um, the protein that I ordered, to, that I ordered, and it's going to come today, one tablespoon yeah, one tablespoon is 30 grams of protein. That's right, 30 grams of protein. When I, I seen this other young lady, I watch her um, beauty videos, but she also had the weight loss surgery also. I'm not quite sure which surgery she had. Um, if, if I don't leave the link in the bottom about time this video upslo uploads, I'll go back in again and upload, um, put her link below. Because it's amazing protein and I want to do a review on it um, what else I haven't really been watching people's videos I'm, I'm missing so many people's videos and um, forms and stuff um, I just really haven't been watching a lot of videos that like I said I went back to work and um, I went back I, I went back to work on Saturday last week Saturday and I was cool like no problems and I can tell the difference in my work habits because I usually complain about like my feet and knees and back and stuff hurting it's not hurting me anymore I can I went yesterday to buy a bra I started out ouch I fell on my butt and it hurts um I started out my bra size was a 40 it was a 44 C yeah, a 40, no, not C, 
a 44 double D. Now I am a 42 D. So my boobs have went down tremendously and I'm so happy because my back doesn't hurt anymore. When they see me at the job Saturday for the first time, they was all amazed because even though I'm not losing a lot of weight, inches are just like dropping off of me like crazy i had posted a picture on instagram like um maybe a couple of days ago yeah maybe a couple of days ago like the beginning of the week and my daughter was like oh my god mom your face is slimming down a lot so um i started out in my uniform tops as a 3x i'm down to a 2x i started out with my pants and my uniform a tight 3x i am a 2x now with a little bit of more room in it so i am losing inches um i'm not losing the pounds as fast which i'm okay with that because i don't you know it's just giving my time body to you know contour into the you know the weight that i'm losing so i don't look um jiggly or um how do you say it like my skin is not hanging or anything so I'm really happy about that I have not joined the gym yet at my job because I just started um, I have to stop at the HR department to um, join up at the gym and it's only eight dollars a month at my job um and what else is going on not really much is going on my friends I'm just really busy at work I'm trying to get into the swing of things um, this weekend will be a test um, it, like my job is like really crazy now um, my floor is so heavy with patients so um, that it didn't tire me out yesterday um, last night when I went to work um, I just really did not feel good at all and I wanted to call out so bad I was at the job and I wanted to go home but I can't because I just went back um, and what else is going on um, I'm really not really doing much not really much at all um my daughter's birthday will be march the 11th so she's turning 21 so um she's getting prepared for that i'm getting prepared for it um because i know you know moms is always doing something um and what else muffins i'm not losing any hair surprisingly um i really don't notice any shedding or anything like that i'm not really losing i always had like a little bit of um thin in here just a little bit um it could be the way that my hair needs to be retwisted so it is kind of looking a little bushy bushy but uh, I'll do it today um what else is going on not that much muffins I'm doing really 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 good um I just want to really up my protein and I'm hoping that this new protein powder that I bought will really really up 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 my protein because I know that, that would help with the weight loss and also getting back into the gym getting to the gym um, and just getting back into exercise and getting back into my normal routine um, kind of feeling normal I've been going through a lot of emotional things right now um, the old me would have eaten my emotions um, away like I would have been snacking on stuff and all of that type of stuff but I'm not um, I'm doing pretty good with it um, I'm just like trying to deal with a lot of things um, like you muffins know I'm single and I have not gotten back out into the dating world yet um, I am planning on going out this weekend finally um, I just I'm excited to get a new outfit and stuff I just want like it's different from shopping now because even though I'm in the large section I'm still in the extra large section it's a plus size section but I can probably just kind of get into the normal clothes that I used to wear um, when I, before I started gaining this weight, I was a size 17, 18, um, and that was pretty comfortable, kind of comfortable for me. Um, I really, really am just, I just want to get into a size medium pants, a size 9, 10, that's my goal. Whatever weight it is, it is, um, I think I'm more focused on what clothes I can get into now. Um, I just, I feel really good, you know, um, through everything that I'm going through, I know things are going to just get better. Um, my emotions will get better. Um, I'm just really proud of myself that I'm not eating my emotions. Um, I do want to start to go to some support groups. I really do want to go to some weight loss support groups. Um, and I also want to get into therapy. I have a lot of things that issues and stuff that I really kind of need to deal with from like childhood and um just you know 
this journey with the weight loss is really emotional. Um, I don't personally see the weight loss. Other people see it. So I could kind of understand when people say, well, I don't see it because I really don't see it and other people see it. And I'm getting so many compliments and it makes me feel really, really good. Um, even though I'm not losing the weight as fast as I want to, um, I'm losing it in due time. And um, I, I think that therapy would really help me, um, you know, to move on from my past relationship. And I'm kind of somewhat hanging on to it in hopes of like things will get better. But she moved on and so it's really time for me to move on. Um, we've been, um, we've been breaking up off and on for many years now but um i think now is time for me to really get in touch with myself and really start doing things for myself personally um usually like every time i you know if i come out of a relationship i jump into a relationship pretty quickly and i don't want to do that there are things that i'm going to be looking for and things that i'm going to not be looking for um in the next relationship that i get into um, I've been approached a couple of times, but I'm I'm really not ready. I want to heal from the last relationship before I jump into something else. And it's, you know, it's been about, I can honestly say about a good 10 to 11 months um, since I've been, you know, interacting with someone. Um, and I'm, I'm looking forward to the dating game again, like the, the dating routine and stuff again. Um, I'm going to start getting out a lot more um, and just like building myself around positive people, you know, um, building new friendships and stuff like that. Because like the weight gain that I had um, was gaining a lot before I kind of isolated myself a lot and I don't want to do that anymore. I really, really don't want to do that anymore. And it's not fair to me to like isolate myself and not build new friendships. And that's what I'm really, really looking forward to. Um, and I have a lot of support, like a lot of people are supporting me, a lot of people are happy for me and stuff like that. So, um, I'm just looking to get back into school and just, you know, going on with my life and not letting like past hurt and anger in 